My name is Salma and I'm an orthotist. So as an orthotist, uh, we do a lot of gait analysis, which is looking at the way people are walking and trying to either improve their mobility and provide them solutions for people who have difficulty with certain areas. The things that we, we can provide are things like insoles, braces, whether that's knee braces, ankle braces, back braces, helmets, to a lot more complex, complex things. So on a day-to-day -day basis, we'll be seeing patients throughout the day. Long-term patients that we have, young children from sort of under a year old to your really elderly patients. And we'll be, again, looking at the problem that they present with and trying to find solutions for their problems that will enhance their mobility and make their lives more comfortable. To get into the profession, you need a background in science and maths, normally physics. Um, you'd need three A-levels um, and the two universities in the UK that offer the course have slightly different requirements for those gradings. Um, if you're coming in as a more mature student, then if you don't have a background in science and maths, often you'll need to do an access course just to get your subject knowledge up. We're a healthcare profession, so you have to come into the profession wanting to care for people. Um, we do quite a lot of practical and hands-on work. You've got to be quite innovative and quick thinking, um, come up with, with different solutions, think outside the box and be a bit creative. The job role is quite specific. If you go, on, go to do a prosthetics and orthotics course, then you are limited in that. You're either going to become an orthotist or you're going to become a prosthetist um, or go into management in those, in those fields. People are come, often coming to you in, in a lot of pain. Their quality of life has deteriorated massively and you're able to try and come up with solutions to try and help them. So number one would definitely be job satisfaction with seeing patients go away happy. You get a lot of job security with it um, and obviously the pay that goes along with that and there's a lot of scope for development in terms of pay grades as well. You can keep progressing and with that obviously your pay packet progresses as well. So you come into work every day, we've seen different people, uh, different types of people, different personalities, you get to interact with lots of different types of people and the teams you're working with, you've got this really good bond and you feel that you're part of something, um, especially when you're working within the NHS.